I'm here at base camp. It's an obstacle course training gym and I'm here to find out how easy it is for a normal person like me to do parkour while dressed as a pirate. I've tested a lot of costumes in this series but testing a pirate is kind of hard because I don't have an exact photo of what a pirate is meant to look like. This costume is loosely based on Captain Jack Sparrow and his get up doesn't seem to stop him from jumping around like a monkey boy. So throughout this test I'll refer to Jack Sparrow's costume as well as historically accurate pirate costumes to get an idea of how functional a pirate costume would be for doing parkour. Or should I say parkour? No? Okay, let's go. <laughs> One of the first things I need to get rid of is all these rings. In your mind, you probably imagine that pirates were always wearing rings, but it's not really the case. On a ship, when you were working with ropes and nets flinging around all day, the last thing you'd want was some bulky metal around your finger just to get caught. So they had rings, but it definitely wasn't something they wore when they were working doing manual labor on a boat. What are you doing? Fundamental pirate skill when you eventually get kicked off the ship. Now this jacket is very restrictive on the arms and all these belts really weigh you down. It's time to do some rope stuff. So with that jump, I had a little bit of trouble with my big baggy sleeves getting in the way when I tried to grab onto the pole. Jack Sparrow's sleeves are insanely baggy. It's ridiculous. Jack Sparrow is a captain, and a captain on board a ship wouldn't have to do the same manual labor as like the normal sailors. For a lot of people, the idea of what pirates wear is based on the famous pirates, and all the famous pirates were captains. The huge majority of pirates who weren't famous captains were not wearing stuff that was baggy and cool and encrusted with jewels. They needed actual stuff they could do work in. Baggy sleeves, parkour, no, no, no. So what did we find out? Is a pirate costume good for parkour? Well, no, kind of. If you're dressed as a captain like I am, no, it's not good for parkour. But even pirate captains back in the time of pirates weren't running around and doing work on the ship. The actual sailors on the ship, from what I understand, have a costume that probably would be pretty good for parkour. They wore tight shirts, so there was nothing to get caught in nets and ropes. Their pants were pretty baggy, which allowed them to climb up masts and up ropes and stuff like that. And they often went barefoot or wear shoes that were pretty flexible. So pirate captain costume, good for parkour? No. Regular a sailor pirate. Probably okay. If you like this series or you think I'm an idiot and want to tell me how wrong I am, jump in the comments or you can watch some of the other ones where I've tested other costumes that will be floating around the screen. Thanks for watching. Peace. Goodbye. If you've got any gold, please send it. Bye.